For this video, we will uh, demonstrate how to install the Mainpine IQ Express fax board drivers. Um, this example here would be 2008 server, but um, all the other versions would be very similar. Um, right when you boot the machine up and power up the, uh, it should actually detect the fax board and actually bring up a found new hardware wizard. Uh, if it doesn't do that, though, uh, you can still install the drivers through the device manager. Um, so how you do that is you go to start, right click my computer, go to properties, device manager, and the main Pine IQ Express revision 3 fax board shows up as a PCI serial port device in device manager. Um, if you happen to have a revision 2 board or revision 1 board, um, this would show up as a PCI simple communications controller instead of a PCI serial port. Um, so, but for this case, it's a revision 3 board, which is the latest version, and uh, this would be a PCI serial port. And uh, what you would do here is you would right mouse click on the PCI serial port, go to update driver software, and then you can browse the computer for the driver software. And in this case, I'm browsing to the CD drive to uh, pick up the uh, driver CD that we provide with the fax board. So it is installed in the E drive currently. So I'll go to next. So it installed the IQ Express 2 port fax board driver. And what you see here is it also adds a driver for each port of the board under the port section and also a modem for each port. In this case it's a two port board so it puts in an IQ Express fax modem and a fax modem number two. Um, if you're on 2008 Vista or uh, 2008 Vista or Windows 7, it would actually install all these drivers for you. If you're on XP or 2003, you actually have to go back to the driver set for each one of these uh, components, like the, the two ports and the two modems in this case. So that is how you would install the uh, drivers for the Mainpine IQ Express fax board.